Should Paul Heckenbottom get the sack? Well, after our first seven games in the Premier League, uh, Sheffield United have only managed to get one point and are currently sitting rock bottom with the, uh, the worst goal difference being the league leaders for goals conceded, which isn't exactly something you want to be league leaders for, and uh, we're also joint last for goals scored. Um, and for that reason alone, I think it's difficult to make a case as to why he shouldn't get the sack. But, you know, that being said, I think there are plenty of reasons why he should keep his job as well. I mean, for a start, I don't know what other manager we could get. We got Ray Heckenbottom who could do as good a job that he's done. I mean, you have to consider that we have a tiny budget that they can work with in January, even want to make any changes to the squad. And then also the fact that no manager wants a relegation on their CV. I think you have to give him the Fulham game, at absolute least. And then if we can't get a win there, we can't get a draw there, maybe it's time to let him go.